Okay, so day 13 of the 60 day video challenge. And for me, I'm gonna just shoot videos back to back because it's easier. So yesterday I posted on my Facebook about continuing my workout routine through walking. And yesterday I took my dog Brady and he and I went for a 2.9 mile walk through the park. We walked to the other side of town. We went back through the park and it was really nice to be outside getting exercise walking with my dog getting him some exercise and just continuing the workout routine walking is something that i really enjoy it doesn't feel like a workout it doesn't feel like exercise even though we were moving and by the end of the walk we were tired um his tongue was hanging out i was sweating a little bit because we move when we when we walk one thing i like walking with brady is because he likes to go he likes to move he doesn't like to walk slow he wants to walk so it forces me to walk at a quicker pace so it's not a leisurely walk when we walk it's we are moving and i really appreciate that with him so with my smaller dog it's more a leisurely pace because his his legs are small, shorter he doesn't go as far as his brother brady and he gets tired quicker but brady likes to go so i like to take brady when i know i want to go for a distance or if i want to go hike a little bit or go through a trail or something Brady is my, my, my partner for that. So anyway, it was just good to get outside, to take the workout outside, to get some sun, to just continue with the workout because I just, I feel better. I just feel better. It's only been five days, but that's a big deal for me. To do five days in a row is something I haven't done in so long. So it feels really good to do that, to be able to do that. So I think I'm going to alternate between the treadmill and walking outside just to switch it up a little bit, just so I don't get bored. Again, when I walk on the treadmill, I won't get bored because I'll have my YouTube videos. So I won't think about working out. I'll be working out, obviously, but I'm not going to think about it and focus on it so much because I'll be distracted. And the beautiful thing about walking outside is one, you're outside two you're enjoying some sun but even if it's cloudy or rainy you're outside so you're constantly you know you're looking around you're 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 not focusing so much on okay I got 30 more minutes to go I have another mile and a half to go you're just you're just walking so for me it feels really good to just keep these workouts going I don't take a day off because like I said if I do I stop I just I stop so I'm going to work out today, not in the morning like I have been doing because I have a lot of stuff to do today, but I will work out this afternoon. And it doesn't really matter for me, necessarily, if I get into a set routine of I only work out in the mornings or I only work out in the afternoons. I think for me to be able to keep this up, I need to be able to switch it up and know, okay, I'm not working out this morning. That doesn't mean the end of the world and oh my goodness. I'll just do it in the afternoon. I have to be able to have that flexibility for me, again, for me, um, to not be so rigid in the routine that it's like, if I don't do it at that set time, it, it's just completely screwed up. So um, the workouts are going well. Walking is doing very well for me. I intend to keep that up. And I encourage other people, if you want to get back into the workout routine, just start with walking because that is a workout that everybody can do regardless of age regardless of you know fitness ability you just walk and before you know it you'll be leading into something else so that is my workout tip for the day and i will see you in video 14. bye